Most agents that leave the business just leave. They just retire, they go to Arizona, they go to the Bahamas, wherever, and their entire book of business goes dead. Because again, do most agents run it as a business or as a hobby? A hobby. So what I'm doing, I'm having multiple conversations right now with agents that are headed towards retiring. And I'm offering to buy them, not only buy them out of their business, but help them create an exit plan that they hadn't even thought of. Pretty simple, you can structure it however you want. However they want is way more important than however you want, by the way. So I, I had a lady the other day, she's in our office. She and her husband did real estate together for a while. Her husband died six months ago. And I reached out to her just to say, you know, sorry. I didn't know them well, to be honest. You know, I kind of had met them a couple times. And she mentioned to me that she was planning on moving to South Carolina. And I said to her, I said, Kate, I, look, I don't want to be crass, but I don't know what your plan is. I would love to chat with you about an exit strategy for you that will continue to make you money for three, four years. And at first she kind of went, yeah, people have asked me about that. And I went, okay, well, you have my number. She called me the other day. She goes, Matt, I want to talk to you about buying, your, buying my business because you're the most aggressive <coughs> one. And I said, you're damn right, and I'm going to keep you making money. So now, a typical buyout plan, you don't pay anything up front. So what I want to do is I want to work with you on, on the buyout of your business, and I'll say, hey, look, a simple way to do it is you just give me your whole database, <laughs> and anything I get out of it, I'll send you 25%. But better yet, if you and I work together and you tell everybody in your database that I am your new partner, as you head off into retirement, my credibility skyrockets in your database, doesn't it? We are now partners. So what she and I are gonna talk about is she's gonna tell her whole database that she has partnered with the ML Real Estate Group and she's super excited because we are gonna take care of her clientele. The more effective I am and she is together at talking to that database, the more money she makes long term, would you agree? I had an agent once say to me, well, I was gonna do it, but the agent wanted five-year payout instead of three, and I was like, why do you care? Who cares? If to make it work, and they're gonna stay engaged, they want seven years of a referral fee, and they're gonna to continue to work their database for you, who cares? That's amazing. So you can go to your local real estate board, and you can see who has not re-upped their membership. Now, some of those people will have just forgotten to pay their membership fee, so it's probably not them. <laughs> like apparently we did the other day. All of a sudden my central lock wasn't working, my key thing, and I was like, why can't I get in? It says I'm terminated as an agent. Yeah, we hadn't paid our dues for like January. Yeah. But get that list from your association and start calling through. You'd be surprised the conversations because if you approach it the right way, you'll find no other agent has approached them that way. Think bigger. Think bigger than the commission. Think bigger than the referral. Think big. How many people can I have that are feeding my business and that have a vested interest in feeding the business.